Get ready to witness some serious dirt busting moves as we pay tribute to Mother Earth on this special day. And as a reward for our hard work, we'll embark on a lit hike to the Suru cabin. It's gonna be so epic, even the trees will be high-fiving us. The mission? To clean up the starting point of the hike, which was low-key beautiful but somewhat neglected and grubby. Listen up, peeps. Earth Day was creeping up on us and my girl's workplace was like, Hold up! We can't let this day go by without some totally important and life-changing workshops! So yeah, we got our recycling game on point and learned some wicked ways to save the planet. Ooh-ha! But seriously folks, recycling is legit crucial, so let's get those trash sorting skills on fleek and rule over the recycling bin like royalty. At first glance we were like, where the heck is the trash? But then we focused in and saw that litter was lurking like a ninja in the shadows. But did that stop us? Heck no! Armed with rubber gloves and trash bags, our team went all terminator on that garbage's butt. If you were a piece of litter, you'd better watch out, cause this squad was coming for ya. These guys were like a swarm of caffeine-fueled ants, leaving nothing behind but a fragrant trail of rainbow colors and the lush greenery of paradise. Dude. The stuff people chuck away is straight up crazy. We're talking jackets, sweatshirts, briefcases, radios, speakers, chairs, massive plastic foil and enough beer bottles to fuel a frat party for a year. It's like the party of the century went down and everyone got abducted by aliens and all their crap crash landed in the river. Or if you're not into intergalactic conspiracy theories. You could believe that people just toss their garbage out of the window as a tribute to the trash god. Both are pretty hard pills to swallow. I'm not gonna lie folks, when it came to the cleaning duties, I was about as helpful as a one-legged horse in a glue factory. My attention was totally hijacked by this adorable little caterpillar. And before I knew it, the rest of the team had already wrapped up and moved on. Dang it, oh well. Maybe next time I'll stick around and witness that cute little bugger transform into a majestic butterfly. Fingers crossed. Anyway, we managed to cover some ground and we're pretty content with what we achieved for the moment, so we headed out to the hike. Guess what, we stumbled upon some beer tracks during our adventure, but no need to panic. I'm pretty confident that I could have outrun at least one of my companions. Listen up folks, us self-proclaimed expert trackers stumbled upon a real head scratcher. This mystery animal had a wonky shape and not a single other track of its kind in sight. After some back and forth, we decided this critter must be a one-legged hopper doing some serious long jumps. We imagine it moves something like this. But hold on to your heads, cause we were later told it was just a dang rock sticking out of the dirt. Poppycock I say! That's clearly the footprint of a wild pogo stick animal. And anyone who says otherwise is just plain bonkers.
and voila, you're at a mountain cabin before you can even say hangry. Let me tell you a little secret, my friend. We were in this cozy cabin that was serving up some kind of magical top secret tea. One of our gang was so obsessed with it that he practically begged the cabin owner to spill the beans on the ingredients. But that sneaky owner wouldn't budge even after getting grilled with question after question. Talk about a teasing mystery. It's a sheer delight to plunk down, loosen up and slurp some lip-smacking soup. But wait, there's more! You can also hop on an eccentric swing that'll make you tingle all over and relieve your hidey days. Alrighty folks, time to bust out of those comfy chairs and get your game face on. I hope this little show and tell has inspired you to go out and track down that pesky pogo stick beast. This critter may be sneaky and sly, but mark my words, it's bound to slip up sooner or later. So grab your gear, sharpen your senses and let's get hunting. May the best tracker win. <laughs>